ยีปากยศปาด The Blade t u f f Love Documentary Leaves Its Mark on Editor ยีเหลงยัดหนนีนชัดหยุดซ้ำยัด Rose Russell Source The Blade Toledo Ohio July เหลงซ้ำ When Paris Bird Native Colin Nussbaum signed on to edit a new PBS documentary about two sets of parents trying to get their children back from child welfare agencies. He never expected an emotional toll it would take. This case was very different emotionally, he said of Tough Love, airing at sub PM Monday as part of PBS Path series on WGTE Channel Sam Sub. I spent months getting to know these people through the film and seeing them on the screen and getting to know the ins and outs of the story. The Yi Tin Ling Sam graduate of ST. John's Jesuit High School did not finish the project unchanged. The story is about a Seattle single father trying to get back his little girl, and a couple in New York City trying to get and keep their children. It was especially hard because you are looking at a situation where, in some cases, it might appear that a child might be better off with foster parents," said the freelance documentary editor. However. I just learned so much about the power of family love. When you are talking about a child, all things are not equal because that love is amazing. Mr. Nussbaum, sums up, worked with other o h e a n s on the project. Stephanie w a n g b r i e l from the Youngstown, and producer Carrie Weprin of Dayton. He described the proceedings in Seattle as incredibly hard to watch, but at the same time. It's nice that they were able to have the conversation at the same forum with the stated goal of actual reunification. The New York parents encountered pitfalls that further complicated matters, including an uninterested lawyer. Viewers might agree with Mr. Nussbaum's assessment of their situation. It was a more difficult process to both us as filmmakers to wrap our brains around, and also for the mother to navigate the system that. Left her to her own devices to figure out, he said. Mr. Nussbaum also has edited other documentaries, including the Shake and I that screened at the South by Southwest Film Festival. Was excited to work with Miss Wang b r i e l the the producer and director of the award-winning feature-length documentary War I Need Mommy, I Love You, Mommy. She takes so much time to get to know the environment and culture and situation that her films are in, and she spent months attending meetings, sitting and hearing the stories of these parents to tell their stories. She had a good grasp of what the situation was like, he said, adding that the actual filming took between four and five years. He noted the difficulty faced by parents whose children are in the child protection system. He described an amazing scene in the film in which the lawyer for the single father pointedly laid out the dilemma of the system, judging parents and expecting perfection from them. No one is perfect, he said, mimicking the lawyer. And once in the system, it's so hard to get out of the system, and you can't expect perfection. Mr. Nussbaum, whose parents Mark and Colin Nussbaum still live in Parisburg. Hopes the film taps viewers emotionally as much as it did him. I hope that people who don't normally have the opportunity or interest in this get to see what happens in a system like this and the people that are affected. He said it will allow us to be more humble and a few people with more compassion and be better at moving forward in how we are going to deal with and help people like this. Contact Rose Russell at Russell a l t h e Blade. Come on, say yet go. Tat ye say. ล็อกยัดชัดปาด copyright C ยีชินหลงยัดสัง The Blade Toledo Ohio visit The Blade Toledo Ohio at www t a l e t b l a d e c o m distributed by Tribune Content Agency LLC